Hey guys, Triple J Boxing here. So there was a very great interview by Fight Hub TV today. Um, check out their channel, great channel guys. Tons of content. Um, so a guy asked him, how do you feel about all the belts? Doesn't it open opportunities for your fighters though? And Oscar De La Hoya responds to there being all these belts and here's what he has to say and then we'll, I'll, I'll give my thoughts on it and I'll discuss it. Perhaps I didn't know being worse for your fighters though. All right, here we go. Here we, we're in a controversial now, all right. <laughs> here we go. So, um, I'm I, actually surprised I, I, he, I he talked like this too. With the world title. That he'd get in trouble or something. I do not agree. With the exception of the Ring Magazine belt. Ring Magazine lineal which is champ. It's technically not an official, you know, belt. Yet it's the most important one. In many people's eyes. I mean, it's the most prestigious. It goes back, it goes over, back 100 over 100 years. years. And there's no politics whatsoever. You're the man who the beat the man. And you win it in the ring against the number one, number two guy. Yeah. Um, and, and that's it. You know? And the only way you can lose it. He's in the ring. And we have the editor-in-chief here. Um, you know, is in the ring. That's it. So, I look, I, I have to play ball with the organizations. Yeah, I'm surprised, dude. Because they, He's not going to get in shit you know, by, like, Suleiman or somebody. Title chances. They position you top ten. But when you start playing with super champion, when you start <laughs> playing with... It makes no Super sense. Super duper champion. <laughs> you know, it's like, it becomes... Mega champ. It becomes confusing. God level the, champ. To the, to the audience, to the... To the, to the it is confusing. Like, it's so confusing when I see super regular. Like, what, what does that mean? And, and, that, and that there is, 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 is not good for the sport, you know? So, you know, when you have a... Too, and too many belts. Who is a great champion, don't get me wrong... We've been, everyone's been complaining about it. From fighting his number one mandatory, his, the next guy in line to, that can possibly beat him, you know, he's exempt from it. Like, so are you a champion or are you not a champion? You, you have to defend your titles. Yeah. It's, 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 it's been changing over the years and I just do not agree with it. A lot and of I people don't. Say that. I do not agree with it because I was in the ring. I stepped inside the ring myself. Oscar fought everybody. You got to give him As respect promoter, there. I know people. I, I know people make it, fun of Oscar. It. They shit on him for the outside of the ring antics yeah. and stuff with Probably his problems. Yeah, but he fought everybody, Oscar. You got to respect him there. He fought all the champs. Look at his resume, guys. Look at Oscar's resume, and he beat some of the best fighters. Um, I think the Trinidad won too. He, he did lose that one, but I thought he won. But he, he took his foot off the gas in the second half, I remember. But he beat a lot of great champions, guys. And he faced everybody, even if he lost. Um, I recommend you check out Oscar De La Hoya's fights for sure. Um, but let's go back to what I think on this. So he's talking about how the like all the the organization, the belt organizations, WBC, WBA, WBO, IBF, they all, not all of them, I think, but a lot of them have the super now champ, the franchise champ. Now he's saying the super duper. It's like the regular champ. Enough is enough. Like, why are you adding all these these belts? And I, I know why they're doing it. it. Because when you make it, oh, this is a fight for a belt, it sells to the casual more or to the fan. Because they're like, oh, it's for a title. These are champions. So they feel like it's more of a marketing ploy. And it's kind of sad because I know boxing's a business, but let's go back to only one belt. Like, even four belts was too much. Like, like I was okay with four, but even I didn't even like four, to be honest. But now we have, like, I don't know how many we got now. It's just insane. Um, let's go back to the one belt, but that will never happen, obviously. Like, it, it will never happen. Um, the ring champ, the lineal champ, that's the most important thing. That you have to beat the best guy to get that. The man who beat the man. And um, a lot of fans feel like this. Maybe the casuals don't care, right? 
And that's why they do it, because they can promote the fight as a title fight for a belt. Uh, that's why they add all these belts, I think, right? Um, it's just a marketing thing, but it's just not good for the spirit of boxing. You know what I mean? We want to find out who the best is and who the champ is. And like you said, now these mandatories don't have to be, they don't have to fight the mandatories, the next guy in line who could beat them. So we'll never know who really is the best until it's too late. One guy's past his prime or it's just, yeah, we want to see the best first, the best. And who, like, we just want one belt. That's why the UFC kind of, it does it better in that sense. How the the guy who's number one usually fights the champ. And if that guy's not available, they go to number two. I'm pretty sure that's how the UFC works. And that's why people like that system. Now, there's pros to cons to both sports. But in that aspect, UFC has an upper hand on uh, boxing. Um, it's just, an, it's nonsense how many belts we have these days. And it's good to see that Oscar Del Hoya at least is speaking up. Um, I know a lot of them aren't going to like what he's saying here. I'm surprised. Like I said, I'm, I guess he doesn't, he's not afraid to speak his mind. So you got to like that here. And um, good on Oscar for uh, telling it the way it is. There's just too many belts, guys. And uh, yeah, belts don't really mean shit sometimes. Like the fans know who's the best fighter. And they know who's their they know who their top rival is. Let's just we know. But we try to we try to just make like the belts are like it, it matters who you beat to get the belt. That's what I'm trying to say. Who did you beat to get that belt? That's more important. Thanks for watching, guys. This is Triple J. Check out Fight Hub. Great interview.